to immersive audio and object-based mixing and things. So just really, really, really quickly, channel-based audio is when you have a stream of audio for each speaker. So stereo, easiest thing to remember, you've got one channel of audio for left, one channel of audio for right. There have been multi-channel formats, which I'm gonna talk about in a second, but they've all been channel-based. You get to something like Dolby Atmos, and it's one of many, many, many formats where it is object-based. So instead of saying, here's some audio, please plug me into a speaker that's on the left side of the room, the audio knows where it's supposed to be. It's like, I am your audio, and I know that I should be a little bit left of center. And then on the playback side, the playback devices say, well, I've got speakers here, 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 and here, so for it to sound like it's coming from there, I'm going to put this much in that speaker, this much in that speaker, and none in the other speakers. But the decision is made at the playback, not at the recording. So the recorder, the mixer says, I want it to be there, and then on playback, depending on the number of speakers and blah, 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 it comes out as close to there as the playback system can make it. So that is object-based. So you get the audio, and then you get what they call panning metadata that says, I want to play from over there. This is the first time, basically in history, where other than you deciding you're going to put your speakers in different rooms, where the playback system is where the decisions are made about how stuff will come out of speakers. It's really, really important. So hopefully everybody gets that now.